and Srivastava from exclusive post. Today we will see what is the difference between wonders of the world and the wonders of our life. We all know there are seven wonders in the world like the Taj Mahal, the Grand Canyon, the Great Walls of China, the Pyramids of Egypt and so on. But are we aware of what are the wonders of our life? These are not man-made wonders. These are created by God. And we are experiencing, we are performing routine jobs with these wonders of the life. And all these wonders of lives are mostly unnoticed by all of us. Today we will compare the wonders of the world with the wonders of our lives. And when we see that the wonders of our lives are more greater than the wonders of our world, then we start discussing about the wonders of our lives. And the moment we start considering that the wonders of our lives are greater than the wonders of the world, we are definitely going to convert our life into a joyous life, into a marvelous life, into a life full of happiness, thrills and adventures. But to understand the wonders of our lives, we have to watch this small video. This video is all about some American children in the school who have discussed the wonders of our lives or rather compare the wonders of our life with the wonders of our world watch this video and then we'll come to know what is more greater wonders of world or wonders of our lives here is the video friends if we start considering the wonders of our life to be greater than the wonders of our world we'll soon find that our life has become more healthy wealthy full of joy and happiness and we have no regrets in our life life becomes wonderful and that is why we say that these wonders are really wonderful for our lives gifted by the superpower the nature the universe if we do not have 
these wonders in our life, then do you think we will be able to see the wonders of the world? If we have no eyes, we have no power to see. If we have no nose, we have no smelling power. If we have no ears, we have no hearing power. If we have no tongue, we have no power to taste. And so, if the nature, the universe has not given you, has not gifted you these organs, our life becomes miserable. We will literally be incapable to see the wonders of our world. So, the wonders of our world, in a way, is of no use if the wonders of our lives are not there in our life. Start feeling great for the nature, for the universe. Convey your gratitude. Be thankful to the nature, to the superpower, to the universe who is giving you grains to eat, water to drink and survive, air to breathe and at the same time the organs, the feeling organs, the smelling organs, the vision that the nature has gifted to us, we will not be able to utilize the grain, the air, the water, whatever. So friends, Please feel grateful to the universe, to the nature. Convey your thanks to the nature, to the universe. And think, just think, if you had no organs of these sorts, if these organs were not gifted to you in your life, how miserable your life would be. So friends, Please think of the reality. We'll soon be back with some precious messages for you. Till then, stay tuned. Keep watching exclusive posts. This is D.N. Srivastava signing off now.